Hey everyone, welcome back for more Exos Heroes content. Today's video, we're going to discuss FC Baraka's Hero Guide. We're going to discuss his stats, skills, playability, synergy with other heroes, his recommended Guardian Stones, overall rating, and my final thoughts. But before that, if you want to see more Exos Heroes content, please hit the subscribe button down below. We're here at Baraka, FC Baraka's profile. So this is his... Uh, Black Boon Baraka FC profile. So his nation is Wasted Red. His element is Machine. Position is Chaos and attack type is Physical. So for his stats, his strengths are he has high attack, he has high dodge, high attack speed, and average hit. But for his weakness, he has low HP, low defense, below average critical hit, and low block. So let's go over to his skills. Currently has three uh, fate cores. One is his King of the Wasted Red, which was released first. So it's a black fate core. The the most recent one, actually not recent, it was released a while ago, but his last fate core is Black Moon Baraka, which is a blue fate core. Okay, so let's talk about his passive. Um, most of the changes for Baraka are in his passive. With his basic um, form, Baraka only has final hit 3. But with his Kim the Wasted Red, with his Black FC, he has Harbinger of Awakening and Awakening. And for this one, for his Black Moon Baraka, Blue FC, so he has Great One, Dragon Blood, Wrath, and Dragon Scale. So. In terms of differences of all the three passives, if you have, you still have his basic form, you get either of the two, either blue or black. But if you have a choice between the blue and the black, I would suggest you pursue the black one because, um, I'm sorry, you pursue the blue one because the black one only has Harbinger of Awakening and Awakening skill for his passive. But for Black Moon Baraka, his blue FC, he has the Great One, Dragon Blood, Wrath, and Dragon Scale, which helps him survive or gives him survivability more than his other forms. Um, again, for, for, for FC Baraka, you need to enhance his survivability because he is so squishy, but he has a high attack and a high rate of attack. Okay, guys, if you happen to like my content, if you want to support my channel, please hit the subscribe button down below. So for FC Baraka's playability, whether whichever form you have, whether you have the blue or the black one, so he is good in PvP tag or main PvP. But for PvE, he is good in your chapters. He is good in your battle or air squadron battle. He is good in your Holy Dragon Grounds during Machine Day. He is good in core raid as well. Actually, in any content needing a guardian, guardian stone break, he is good because um, his wrath actually triggers a guardian stone break as well. So if you have the opportunity to awaken him and or or elemental enhance him, the better so that he could deal damage and break more guardian stones. So far, FC Baraka's recommended guardian stones. Uh, the one thing that you should address is his survivability. So there are only two Guardian Stone sets that I'm recommending whether you equip them or you awaken them. Um, uh, they're, they're both the same. So the, the first one that I would recommend is Fire Set Effect for Equipment Set. So it gives him a damage reduction of up to 20%. And when you awaken him, he will be given a plus 5,000 for each HP. But the one that I'm recommending the most is we'll, we'll be giving him both of those stats, namely HP and dodge rate, is your nature set effect. So for equipment set effect from nature, he will be given a plus 20 for dodge, but when you awaken him with the nature set effect, you'll be given a maximum of plus 2,000 HP and dodge rate of plus 12 so um it gives him more survivability 
And now we discuss with synergy with other heroes. So um, he synergizes well with heroes that give him increased defense and increased HP. Also, for heroes that um, increase his attack as well, because Baraka is a hero that needs to move on the first or the second turn and deal a lot of damage. So survivability and increased attack is one of the things that he needs for him to function very efficiently. Um, one particular hero that um, that gives Barak an edge is FC Annie because of FC Annie's passive that grants um, grants mana and grants additional speed. So as long as FC Baraka is the is the highest uh, or has the highest speed in your team, FC Ani will give her that passive. So for my overall rating, so one being lowest, five being the highest. So stat wise, um, Baraka is a four because he's one one of the highest stat in terms of attack or in terms of a attack character or a chaos character he has one of the highest stats so for attack hit dodge and attack speed so all you need to to do is to make sure that he survives um the first round or the second round for him to deal multiple attacks so for playability in terms of uh, content he is well-rounded in terms of content but he needs to have the support um, in terms of survivability again and increase of attack. So that, that is why I gave, gave him a 4. For synergy with other heroes, um, his stat is also a 4. To be honest, increased defense and HP is actually a plus. The thing that you should need to increase with him is his attack so that he could deal um, as much damage as possible in the first round and also in the second round and let's say if you already have Baraka is fated the form um, would you need an FC I think yes because uh, giving him an FC number one enhances his stats number two gives him additional passives but also Please try to get the blue Fate Core Baraka, not the black one. So for, so, so for my final thoughts, so for Baraka, he needs to go fast and hard and repeat if possible. So it, it, it's, uh, it's a must that he has early mana early on because I'll give you a tip guys. Um, if he has 5 mana and if you use his S1 and if he kills another hero, Oh, sorry, if he kills an enemy, he you will be getting a second turn using his S2. So all you need is 5 mana, 2 mana for S1, and 3 mana for his S2. He is very effective in killing heroes uh, and squishy ones on the opposite side. Uh, that is why he has a good first and second turns. And that concludes this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below, your suggestions, your comments, and you all stay safe. I'll see you in the next video. Warden out.